First of all, uh, nice. What? The uh, bottle there. It's I am your... not drunk. No, she's I'm not sick. drunk. She's not. It was her birth. Her birthday's tomorrow, so. Uh, no, I'm was... not turning 21. No, she's not turning 21. <laughs> I know she looks young. <laughs> Okay, let's talk about Supernatural, and then we'll go on to Riverdale in the next video, and <sighs> trying to stop. still scares me. What's that? Lucifer still scares me. Oh my gosh. I, I know that so many people have said that he's not that intimidating anymore. I, I am terrified of him. Just seen how he reacted to the demon when uh, the lady got away. Oh, yeah. Uh, before before we begin, yeah, spoilers. Woo! We're going to be talking hey. about major spoilers in this. In this, uh, We're going to be talking about major spoilers, so just want to let you guys know. Uh, I should also note that I am sleep deprived, so I am going to be weird. I made the mistake of telling her something scary <laughs> at uh, 3 o'clock in the morning. It's not your fault. Kind of. I could have... Uh... I could have thought you, of that. I watched Supernatural, Teen Wolf, American Horror Story, and all manner of horror movies without blinking. And you just tell me one creepy pasta, and I'm up all night. So sounds like double know. standards. Even if it is, I still feel bad about it. Don't feel bad. Anyways, I'm a little out of it, but we're gonna we're gonna get through this. Yes. So go ahead. Yes, with Lucifer's reaction to when. Um, day gone. Just seeing her fear of him when she knew that she had screwed up. Messed up. Yeah, definitely. That was terrifying. And his reaction. I know. Because I was like, I was, um, I wasn't looking at that moment. I was pouring my soda at that moment. And when he gave out that blood curdling screech, screech. I, I like. Almost poured my soda all over myself. <laughs> it's like, ah! Oh, I will tell you this, though. When it first started with Kelly just kind of sitting there all dirty and, like, being force-fed those pills, I just felt so bad for her. What were those her. pills? It looks like it was just, like, vitamins or prenatal, something. Prenatal, maybe? What's that? Prenatal? Like, prenatal vitamins? Yeah. Maybe. I, I can know. imagine that the demon would only think about the baby. Yeah, she doesn't care about Kelly. It felt so bad for Kelly, and um, when she did try to take her life in that moment, um, I understand. I mean, she was scared. Yeah. I am glad, though, that she survived, and I do hope the baby is good. I, I hope really so, too. Do. I keep thinking about Jesse, and I keep thinking about how the show has always shown, like, second chances and well, the Well, given that it managed to... Uh... Okay, that's another spoiler. No, no, it's fine. I've already announced all the spoilers. Um, given the fact that the baby uh, got Cass on its side. Yeah, what yeah. What it showed him? I know. What did Ugh. it show him? Or like, and now I did it show him anything, or did it? I think it did both. Him. It. I think it did both. Gave him power briefly, mm -hmm. and then uh, and showed him what. Whatever it did. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's a good point. That's a good... What are you doing? Um, that is such a good point. Ugh. About that, uh, situation. <laughs> that was pretty awesome to see Cass taking out Dagon. I'm glad she's gone. Mm -hmm. I'm glad Dagon is gone. I couldn't, I couldn't resist that one. But. I've been saving that the day one. Day is back. Hashtag day gone is day gone. <laughs> Wait, what do you think of that one? Did you, or did you, I, did your IQ drop a few points there? I want to drown myself in this now. <laughs> in my soup. I drive her to drinking soup. Yes, nothing says a good old time with a bud like soup and alcohol. Or Pepsi and Hershey bars, uh, and pills. Uh, that ignore those. Mm. Uh, <laughs> uh <laughs> what did you think of that moment with the cult? Oh shit! Oh my gosh! I cannot believe that happened. Dean's face—he was so sad. I have a feeling that the cult won't be down. Forever, though. I hope not. I mean, they've lost it before. Become iconic. 
It is iconic, and Dean never got to shoot it Once. in this episode, in this season. Well, like, he's usually been the one to use it in, in the previous seasons, and this season he never got to shoot it. He never got to use it to kill a big bad. It, it was Sam, and Sam's awesome and everything. I just felt bad that Dean didn't, didn't get to use his baby. <laughs> his two babies, the cult and baby. <laughs> Speaking of baby, oh my god! Oh, I remember J squared at a convention talking about how someone steals baby, and everyone was trying to speculate because they said an actress did something, or the actress's buddy double did something, and it was a funny story. And I was like, oh, I wonder if you know, since it's an actress, if it was Mary who took the who took baby, or if it was Dagon who Oops. took baby. Crap. But crap, crap, it crap, was crap. Kelly. Crap, crap, crap. You got anything? Yeah. So I am a, I am a dork. Of, instead of rushing to help you, I just videotape it. Uh, let me see if I can find something to help with that. I'm such a dork. So, uh, um, yeah, stuff. I want you to run to the bathroom and, and grab something. Um, so while you're in there, I'll just continue. What the heck are you doing? Kimmy, you yeah, desecrated Kimmy, Mr. Uncle Squirrel. Uncle. Mr. Squirrel has been desecrated. That's not a real squirrel, I swear. It's a, it's a fake squirrel. It's tail squeaks. Um. <laughs> no reaction. She's like, nah. Um. Baby getting stolen was kind of funny, though. Because you get to watch Dean and Sam having a moment to hot rod a, or fix up a truck. Mm -hmm. That was awesome. I loved. I, speaking of the truck, again, changing the subject. Uh, no, 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 go ahead. I loved uh, when uh, Cass put it on his phone how to fix a truck. I know that was funny. <laughs> and as soon as there was the knock on the door, I was like, "Oh, are we gonna get a punch in the face?" You might want to answer that door ducking. Because <laughs> they they were seriously that was hilarious. They're like, "How how did you not think we weren't gonna find you?" And, you know, I get Cass's motives of trying to keep them out of it, but it's like, when have they ever stayed out of it? Like, mm -hmm. people who love them have tried again and again to try to keep them out of it, and they always find a way in, and they always find a way to defeat the evil, so stop leaving Sam and Dean out of it! Woo. They're the ones who can help! <laughs> if you just trust them. I was actually surprised that Kelly didn't want to do that uh, maneuver with them. That they that was a really smart idea that um, Sam came up with. And remember how we both were sitting there when he came up with the idea to take the grace out so that it would be a human baby. And you and I just sat there and went, wow, at the very same time that Dean was like, hot dog. Hot damn. Uh -huh. <laughs> that was awesome. Like we both kind of were like, that is impressive. That was, that was a really good idea, but Kelly didn't want to do it. Kelly wants the baby to stay a Nephilim. I was a little surprised by that. I, that's what concerns me. Why is it so important that the baby stay a Nephilim? Why, why doesn't I'm she like the, the idea of, I'm guessing the baby uh, spoke to her. Like, yeah. like you said, she got received a vision from the baby. Maybe the baby wants to stay in Nephilim. Yeah. And then, I, you know, and it's like, okay. There's but another Kelly, reason, but do you why? really want to have to deal with this? You you could die having the baby. And it sounds like she's accepted that. She doesn't really care uh -huh. anymore. She's like, Cass, you're the new baby daddy. <laughs> now, me, I have uh, to say that'd be cool. Makes me wonder if... <gasps> the... Whoa! Kimmy! Sorry, everybody. Uh, Kimmy stepped on her tail again? Is that what you did? What I don't know what she did. She just yelped. <laughs> you okay, girl? What did you Scare do, yourself? baby? She was playing with the squirrel. Did the squirrel fight back? <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. Sorry. Um, I couldn't resist. If anyone doesn't get that reference, good. Don't ever find out. Um, <laughs> can be up till five in the morning. Anyways, uh... You met with a terrible fate. Haven't you? <laughs> Anyways, what was I saying before Kimmy scared us half to death? And... Oh, I like the idea of Cass raising the baby. Cass gets to be a daddy. Dad's DL. That's what I've seen people call him. Dad's DL. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. Better than some things. You know, honestly, I kind of like 
just uh, Kelly and Cass kind of going off and uh, dealing with the baby. We know that Sam and Dean are, of course, going to jump in and help in any way they can, but I, I do like the idea of Cass and Kelly kind of doing this whole thing with them, and then Sam and Dean have to deal with the British Men of Letters, because it looks like the next episode is going to get really, really bad. Mm -hmm. It looked like, okay, it looked like to me like Mary was being held captive. Look, I saw they had a syringe thing. Yeah, and it looked like she was struggling. So I, I really hope that, like, Sam and Dean find out that she's in danger and come to her rescue. Because, I mean, is she and Ketch, it, it looks like she and Ketch had a fight. Then it didn't go well. <laughs> so... That was, that was bad. That was bad. So I guess like our main theory is that the baby will be good. That's what we're hoping for anyway. Yeah, son of a big enemy turns out to be good. Yeah, and maybe. I've seen that done re really well I before. like that trope. I've actually the grown tired has. of the whole baby being born from evil, so therefore it is evil trope that I've seen in movies nowadays and TV shows. I really like the trope of, like, redemption and such, you know? Mm -hmm. And maybe the Nephilim can be the the thing that traps Lucifer back in the cage. I like, don't want you, Daddy! Yeah, no! No, 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 <laughs> Jen. Not the mama! <laughs> oh, yeah, exactly. I can imagine this child, if done right, it would be, like, protective of its mother. Yeah. Well, if if he if he gets to see his mother, yes, because there's still the whole matter of her having the baby and dying in the process, which is sad to me. But I, I do I love get, that well, she's if, kind of if the baby tries to keep her alive somehow. Yeah, if the baby wants her to survive, that'd be awesome. We'll we'll see. But I mean, we're still we're going off hoping that the baby is good. There is still the possibility that the baby is bad. So, if the baby is bad, that's too bad. If the baby is good, that'd be good. You know, we'll just see what happens with that. Any other son of Lucifer is a good son little of cuddle bug. The son of Lucifer. Did, I think we've had that before. The son of Lucifer being. I don't know. Jensen um, was in a movie called The Bower where he turned out to be the son of. <laughs> the son of the devil. Oops. <laughs> Anywho. Dad, uh, I don't want to be no, evil. I don't want to be evil. You me must, alone. my son. You must, my son. <laughs> Everything that the light touches is our enemy. <laughs> Everything that the light touches is yours to burn. Have fun. <laughs> um, I'm really hoping for Crawley and Rowena to make another comeback. That would be awesome. We'll see what happens there. Yes. I guess. <laughs> yes. Uh, anything else that you want to you wanna say before we cut the video? Because, unfortunately, we can't do a too long of a video like we used to. Because YouTube won't allow me to do it. So, I'm going to cut the video short. So, any other thoughts you have on Supernatural? Mm, give me a second. That's what's going to be. Is YouTube's going to be like, Dagon's oh, dead your friend again. took too much. Uh, what? Dagon's dead again. Dagon's gone. Dagon is Dagon. I don't miss her. I hated that woman. I'm... Joshua! That stunk so bad. I hope he's not really dead. I hope so, too. I hope that was just like a psych. <laughs> I don't know. I really maybe, like Joshua. Or maybe Chuck steps in because he likes Joshua. Yeah, maybe. Eventually. That'd be awesome if Chuck came back kind of helped out with the whole situation. We'll see what happens. That was a huge shock. Why went I so fast? I know that sometimes that happens in Supernatural where a character that you've known for so long just suddenly dies. Blech. And you're like, no! So at least Balthazar got to be cradled when he died in the arms of Castiel. You know, that was, that was a bummer, but you know. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Peace uh, out, boobs. Peace out. <laughs> Thanks so much for listening. And uh, if you want to watch my Riverdale one, that'll be the next video. Thanks so much. Bye.